Hey bosses, it's Nina. So you know that as soon as a new feature comes out, I have to like jump all on it and I get obsessed. And I'm so excited that I finally got this little IGTV button. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you all about how to use IGTV from your desktop. If you still don't have the button, I'm gonna give you two hints. One, I have another video on how to do it using BlueStacks emulator. Two, I don't know if this works, but I was trying to get someone to give me this um, link if you go to igtv the link is actually your handle then slash channel if someone can try that just go to instagram.com slash your um online i don't know why i don't want to call it a handle but your handle and then slash channel and let me know if it comes up for you and then i'll just spread the word to everybody else because i know it's frustrating when you don't get the new features and everyone else does with that said, let's go into this tutorial. If you haven't seen any of my other tutorials, I'll put them somewhere on the screen and click on the eye in the top right hand corner. And I've went over what it is, how to use it from your desktop, how to use it from your phone, all of that kind of stuff. But for now, let's concentrate on how to use it from an internet browser. I'm using Chrome, not sure if that matters at all, but um, I just went and logged in. This is my personal account, so travel and all of that kind of stuff. Click on IGTV, and the first thing, and again, this says between 15 and 10 seconds. You can upload a video between 15 and 10 seconds. Um, excuse me, between 15 seconds and 10 minutes. When I use the app, it says between 15 seconds and 15 minutes, which is weird. Okay, I'm gonna click on upload. Notice I've actually already created my channel. I'm assuming um, even on the desktop, um, you'll probably be prompted to create a channel before you do this. Um, I created my channel from my phone. I love that you can drag and drop. You have to have a video that's at least 15 seconds and no more than 3.6 gigabytes. Notice the file type is an MP4. Um, if you don't know how to convert your files, just let me know and I'll do a video on that. I'm just bringing over a video from when I was in Jamaica a couple weeks because I super duper miss it. And I think this one is, I was at the Moon Palace Resort. And so you'll see that it's gonna upload, let's see if it's faster than the app I was using. It does seem to be a little faster. So keep in mind, of course, you do have to have a channel. You can create that from your phone or from your desktop. Um, you do have to have a vertical video. It has to be at least 10 seconds, right? And unless you're a huge IG, um, you have a huge IG following, or if you're verified, um, if, you, if you're verified or have a large following, you can upload up to an hour. If you're not one of those big, super duper Instagram stars, you are limited to your 10 minutes. A um, Couple of other things in that area is when you upload it, um, of course, it does have to be vertical. Now, um, so vertical MP4, right? And you could have either a 4-5 ratio or a 9-16 ratio. There is a calculator for those of you that have dimensions that you're using for your videos and the things that we have to put in. Um, I have a separate video on how to kind of format your videos um, for upload. I'll include that link. Now, I'm going to skip the cover for now. I'll create another video on how to upload um, a cover and create one and all of that. But I'll go ahead and create a title. This is going to be my super awesome. My phone is ringing. We're going to pause for a minute. All right, I'm back. Um, so I'm back. I'm in my super duper awesome video test for IGTV. I'm going to actually delete this because I'm not ready to actually upload videos for you. I'm doing it for y'all. I'm doing it for the tube. Okay, so my super awesome video test for IG, I can add my description. Now, one thing I love is that you can add links in your description, they say. So let's test that. Let's go to, oops, not YouTube, Instagram dot com slash randomly Nina I'm gonna include both okay biz and personal I can make it visible on Facebook but look at how it's like turning oh I like it I can put it on any of the pages I'm not gonna scroll down I have a lot of pages that I'm connected to but I can actually um, post it on my page 
one thing to keep in mind is I don't see my personal page and it does say to your Facebook page and not your profile um, and it says go to a different page linked account so I don't know if this is I, I don't know I have my Facebook connected to a bunch of junk so um, right now I don't see my personal page I did scroll down off off camera um, but keep that in mind but that it looks like it might just be your pages leave me a comment below if you get your actual um, personal page right what I love about online and I've been waiting for this is that you can save it as a draft and post it later I'm gonna go ahead and post this now if you want to go back and edit or change the name or description you cannot do that from your phone you actually have to do that online so I'm gonna wait to see it's pulsing super cute okay now that it's uploaded and it's prepared and posted and all of that it tells you when you were when it was posted I'm gonna go ahead and click on this notice that yay my links are live I like it that is like my thing that I, I haven't been like I've been excited about this but still trying to figure out my strategy but I like that you have links in this this actually makes me want to use it even more so notice this is my Pinterest I have a Pinterest add-in on um, Chrome so I'm assuming I can actually pin this to Pinterest as well um comments will be here and then there's something I'm looking for let me see there's edit video which is fine I'm looking for the button that looks for the insight so give me one second alrighty so I checked the site and it looks like um, for now I could only see insights from the Android app or actually from the app either iPhone or Android it doesn't say anything about desktop so um, check on my other videos on how to see that but I'm super juiced if I click on this I can like my own um, like my own video I can save it um, it doesn't give me the categories that I have on my phone which I do like um, I can edit or delete the video which I will in a minute but I like that I can actually change the description and um, the title after I've already posted one last feature I do want to show you before I sign off here is that you can watch it in full screen mode which is weird because full screen mode is what landscape so um yeah I don't know what you're doing there Instagram but the whole vertical movement isn't really vertical anyways ciao for now y'all oh just check out my other videos that I have on Instagram TV aka IGTV I'm gonna be trying to I'm going to try to do a bunch of videos to help people out um, on IGTV because I know a lot of the people who aren't techie get these new features and then there's this huge gap in these techie people and then the other people who have businesses or are creators so I'm gonna try to help um, take that gap and make it smaller so you too can create a strategy to release your items on IGTV if you do have a channel please leave your channel name below just the at sign and your channel name don't leave a link because um, YouTube will delete it but leave your channel name so I can see what you guys are doing um, or if you want to tell me what you're gonna create a channel about let me know all right